Okay, I got that thug that time. I actually went straight to him and killed him first. And that worked much better because if you kill him first, he doesn't get to run. So, uh, anyway, welcome, Tube Dwellers, to Assassin's Creed 3. I am your host, the Mad Bag, and that is a dead thug. Aw, yeah. So, uh, if you're confused, in the end of the last episode, I failed to catch a thug. He actually got away. And, uh, there. Maybe that was him. I don't know, maybe it was one of his buddies. Either way, I'll do some more of that in the future. So let's get right over to this storyline mission. A mere 40 meters. Oh man, I've got a, I've got a, oof. Okay, let me get rid of this notoriety. Hold up! And, uh, I have gotten rid of my ah, notoriety. Connor! What a relief! You came! <laughs> Allow me to... To introduce you to William Dawes and Robert Newman. You have to forget the jump? John Pitcairn was here. Forgive ah, the jump, I mean. He's readying an assault on Lexington, where Adams and Hancock have taken shelter. I actually had After another wee crash. He will march on Concord, hoping to destroy our weapons and supplies. You must help us. Only tell me where to find him, and I will put a stop to this. He has dozens, if not hundreds, of soldiers at his command. You cannot hope to match him by yourself. But fear not, for you will not have to. We have an entire army of our own, merely awaiting the order hmm. to take up arms. Instead of assassins? Then you must call upon them. It will be patriots. Indeed. You and I will cross <laughs> the Charles River and rouse the boys. William, I need you to take the overland route and do the same. Robert, I need you up in Christchurch. Like the signal, two lanterns, our enemy comes by sea. Sounds like we may have a proper assault ready. No time for dawdling, my friend. We have lives to save. Come on. Which will be much more potent than a proper a pepper. <laughs> oh, the cheesy jokes. Frontier, April 18th, 1775. Huh. They've only left a single horse. We'll have to ride. What? Together. Are you kidding me? Ah, you take the reins, I'll navigate. This, Quickly, uh. Connor, get on the horse. I'm just gonna let the boat go. This is careless. Connor knows it. Something's amiss. I feel I'll like do not trigger open conflict. Follow my directions, and we'll be done in no time. Wow, he is he's really there. Press T to ask for directions. Go left up here. Okay, so I'm gonna take a left next. That's kinda interesting. Whoa! What whoa! Hold up. We have some invisible wall right in the middle of the road. <laughs> Stopped me dead in my tracks. I guess we can uh, can we can we full on run? It's not gonna let me spur the horse and full on run. We've got only a uh, a gallop. Only a gallop huh? allowed. Whoa! Hold up. Red coats. Yeah. What are they doing here? They are attempting to engage me in open they conflict. Scouts. Oh my god, they are seriously careful, all over the Connor. place. We mustn't let them warn the others. <laughs> oh boy. Paul Revere. Okay, hold on. Uh, this isn't Paul Revere, but some uh, some realization just dawned on me. Uh, Paul Revere is the guy who rode through a number of villages over here Go in the east coast here. yelling the redcoats are coming, right? Uh, I was getting ready to take a right. Is that okay? Here we are. Best to continue on foot. Okay, so are we still... It looks like I still have the optional objective to not trigger open conflict. I'm okay with that. He did say left up here, didn't he? I wonder if I could call, uh, Stephane. Oh, man. There are a bunch of red coats. Oh, my God, they saw me for a split second, but it's okay. Uh, can they see me way out? I think I can run around them. It's looking like it. Sweet, so I'm just going to keep my distance. I'm going to run on the outside of this green circle on my mini-map if possible. Hey, uh, can, can old Chunker Butt back here, can he free run? That would be handy. Somehow I doubt it. His hands are too soft for free running. The bark would scrape them and callous them. He wouldn't be able to do his good pin riding. Reduce distance to target. Oh, uh, uh, oh, 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 hold up. Hold up. I hope you can hide, dude. Uh, corn. I have seen corn to be... We will never finish in time if we go by foot. What? Are you kidding me? You said we were going to get off. Take it from here by foot. Um, I feel like the minimap is not going to tell me 
about potential dangers ahead. Uh, so far it's doing alright, honestly. There are some more guards. Uh, Connor? Did I make a mistake getting off the horse? I'm starting to think I made a mistake getting off the horse. Uh, it looks like the guards don't mind, though. Huh. Well, I see a large green area, and you know what? This barn... Well, you know what? Let's let's jump back on. Is he going to get back on with me? The search on foot. No, he actually wants to get down and get on foot. Okay, well, you, you said it. You actually said both of them. I don't know which is the right way. Let's let's go over to this barn. This barn had some uh, some uh, soldierly type gentlemen out in front of it. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe they're just civilians, actually. Um, yeah, I'm confused. Uh, officially confuzzled. Hmm. Hmm. Well, let me... So wait, the horse is going to follow me? So am I just supposed to get through this area on foot and then get back on the horse? It doesn't exactly the horse, make a lot of sense. Okay, here, how about this? Uh, let's get back on the horse. I'm going to ask him for directions. He's going to tell me to get off the horse. I'm going to tell him his directions suck. And then maybe I can just... <laughs> <laughs> this is almost comical. Almost. It's actually annoying. Okay, let's run out of the green circle over here. He just pointed. Where are you pointing, guy? You don't know what you're talking about. Does Stop talking. Does any of this look familiar to you, Connor? I don't know. Is it supposed to be familiar to me? It's Lexington, you right? For this. I mean, I just, like, Quicker ran through it. For what? What are we doing here, man? I don't understand. Oh, you know what? I'm probably being stupid. Ah, there's a white door over there. Let's uh let's see about that. Let's see about this white door. Ah this is yeah. It. There you we have go. Got the right place. Okay. Wow, his directions. He couldn't have said that house over there or go knock on that door. Let everyone know that the regulars marked for Lexington and Concord. The British are coming! Ha, ah, here we go. Back in the saddle, my friends. All we have more people to warn. Ah, yes, more people to warn, huh? Wait, is is this is this Paul Revere on the back? This might actually be Paul Revere. I don't know, not that I ever uh, saw a picture of him in my Excellent. history we classes. Are, right on are we? Are we now? If I can avoid open conflict, that will be excellent. Excellent. We are right on course. He, he points. I guess the pointing is decent. He did kind of yes, point towards the house. Exactly oh, nice. He just did the devil horns. Whoa. He wasn't pointing that time. He was saying, it's time to rock out. It is metal time. Yeah. Excellent. We are right on course. Let me hear that solo, Mr. Revere. And let's see where the course this leads. This way, Connor. Aha. Uh -huh. The green. It has receded. Careful, Connor. There might be other scouts around. Other scouts. Huh. So, uh, so what? Guys that aren't going to show up on my mini-map? I think that's... Whoa. I think that's quite the possibility. I wonder. This water looks a little deep. I probably can't go through it. Uh, especially not with, uh, old chunky butt on the back of my horse here. To the left, um, Con to the left. Go what do you right, mean? Connor. <laughs> to the left, Connor. Go right, Connor. This guy and his directions. I did find a way across the river, and it looks like it's not watched very well. Oh, God. There are redcoats in the bridge. In that covered bridge that I will be able to avoid. Aha, what is this? Might be safer if we approach the houses on foot. Yeah, I agree, I agree. So, uh, let's do that. Uh, right Careful, up the back Connor. way here. There might be other scouts around. Yeah, there might be scouts not shown on the mini-map, I know. Let's see, uh, can he give me directions? Is he gonna still give me directions? Ah, uh, he does still point! Haha. -ha. Okay, Polly boy. Show me the way here. I think he pointed over here. Let's see it again. Let's see it. That way, actually. Okay. I do see a house over here. So far, I see a pretty nice lack of the coming redcoats. Huh. Where are we at here? I see two houses. Need the door. Ah. This door, maybe? This is ah. it. You have got the right place. Maybe. Aha. There we have it. Spread the word. The regulars are coming out. At once! The regulars? What are you saying, man? 
That's the wrong line! You're not supposed to say regulars! You're supposed to say the redcoats are coming. Yes, this is exactly where we need to be. <laughs> With the devil horns. I feel like uh, I feel like he should be screaming at me in Cookie Monster tones. Uh, was there a way across right here? This looks like a horse probably couldn't make it. Oh, I almost want to try though. Everything looks the same at night. Um. Okay. No. No. Not gonna keep trying it. Uh, I see some rocks going across here. I just really feel like... No, no. Uh, so we're at a bridge. This looks like there's not going to be an easy way across this. Anywhere. Uh, I guess I could go in right behind. Yeah, this is barely going to work. But I think so. They go just right, don't Connor. notice the horse I'd footprints. The horse the on foot. footfalls. Might be safer if we approach the house on foot. Is that dog one of their dogs? I know enemies can have dogs that will uh, alert them to your presence. This is it. You have got the right place. All right. Well, let's keep on warning. Bring the Minutemen out. The militia. Um. The regulars are coming. Here. We're here. Oh boy. Here we go. What? Why would Connor run? That's silly. No. 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 Ah, reach Prescott's Landing within the given time. Two minutes. I did successfully not trigger open conflict. Uh, can I take the fence? I want to take the fence. Uh, I was supposed to go right anyway. Oh my god! Down we are. We gotta keep going, horse. I hope you're okay. No, no, this is not a good way to deal with the situation because, uh, they are, uh, they're gonna delay me way too much. There's no way I'm getting this two minutes if I'm fighting. I gotta be basically perfect to get this two minutes, I think. And especially having to dodge the big guy attacks. Please give me a red attack. Ooh, nice! I actually came out of getting hit by the big guy by blocking a shot from a little guy. The grenaders, I think the big guys are called. I need to get used to that and start using it. Come on, come on, take him down quickly. I've only got a minute left here. Oh, please. Okay, I was, was just getting ready to defense break. It doesn't matter now, though. Oh, come on, horse. No, why are you running from me? Horse, horse. No joke. Get up here. Get up here now. Get up here right now. 45 seconds. Oh, my God. It's taken way too long. Can I cut across the field? That actually sounds like a good idea. Last time I jumped a fence, though, it got me in a lot of trouble. It slowed me down just enough. Oh, man. Oh, I don't think there's going to be an easy way across this river. Ah, uh, screw it. I'm going to try it. Aha! I made it. Okay. Left. Left. Okay. Keep showing me, man. We're getting close. If I still get this time sink, I'm going to be amazed. There's no way. 20 seconds. I have no idea where I'm even going. I've got some rocks up here to my right, so I need to be careful trying to cut through. I'm going to try it, though, still. Because I'm pig-headed. I'm just going to belligerently truck on through here. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, it's not. It's a pine tree. Oh! Those notorious Go pine right, trees in there. Go right? What are you talking Turn about? Right. Turn right. Yeah, sure enough. Failed the time. Oh, well. Uh, let's see how far off I am. Horse. No, no horse. Not the jitters. My horse is getting jittery. I can't stop him. Okay, well, um, my God. Oh, this is ridiculousness. Okay, finally off the rock. Oh, my God. Is this it? Where are we yes, going here? This is it. This is the way. Oh, man. There's a feather up there. You know what? I already screwed my time. I don't even care. I'm going to stop and get this uh, feather. Connor? Shut up, Paul. You're a fool. Come on. Where do I have to come from to get this feather? Seriously? Way over here? Maybe? Huh. I can't tell. That's where it looks like this limb comes in from. Huh. Can I just climb one of these trees? Ah, that. Yes. Okay. That'll work. What are you doing? And I'm betting, yeah, sure enough, I can jump. Ah, yeah, we have it now. Let us get a feather. I'm pretty sure that if I would have just ran right to begin with, I probably would have made it up here with uh, little or no issue. Uh, in time, I mean, I would have made the full Is sink everything point. Is right, my friend? Man, Paul, you are you're one annoying mofo. I tell you what. Using the wrong... What? What just happened? We have merged. What do they call that dance in Dragon Ball Z where they touch fingertips and become one? 
they fuse, that's right. The fusion dance or something like that, I don't know. No, not the fusion core dance. <laughs> that is something totally different. Well. To the right, Connor, to the right! <laughs> this guy, I swear. Him and his directions. You know what, we're taking another detour. I see a treasure chest. And you know, honestly, I really don't care about your timeline, Mr. Paul. Because, uh, uh Connor? if I have to face the thousand men of, uh, John Pitcairn by myself, I'm actually fine with that. Uh, come on, where is this? Is it up top? It doesn't necessarily look like it. I don't know. There's some stuff I can't see there. Uh, let me try this. Let me see where I can get. Uh, Connor? This looks somewhat promising. Maybe? Uh, I don't know that I can swing or get to the other side of this beam. Uh, that's pretty silly. I see a void over there. It's gotta be. It's gotta be. Right over here. Right? I can get back on the race. horse, Connor. I'm not gonna get back on the horse. Oh, it's even louder. It's on the roof. I can't believe how much of a fool I am. Yeah, of course it is. Can I just get straight up there? Oh, no, of course not. We have to find a special way up. Any boards I can grab a hold of? No, still not yet. Out of uh, a tree Connor? then, huh? We'll give that a try next. That seems very likely. Oh, oh, wow. Barely got it. Pretty steep roof, doesn't even matter. Um, I'm actually probably going to need to be on the front of this if I had to guess. Finally, okay, well, now that we are a uh, full Connor? half hour late to one of the redcoats, I just got saddles. Oh my god, that was a little bit high. Where did the horse go? Is the horse inside? No, there he is. He might have been, actually. Come on up, Polly boy. All right, right show me the way. Give me your crap directions. Just dismount for this. It'll be quicker and quieter. Yeah, right. Right there's the door, right? This is it. You have got the right place. So, red coats again. Let me guess. Feeling riskier by the minute. Where the devil is he? Are you sure we are in the right place? Oh, sure, I'm sure. You know of. Whoa! Prescott? <laughs> Evening, gents. <laughs> Listen, the regulars are out. You need to rally your men. And, uh. put on some trousers. At once! I'm thinking we should go chase down this damsel that just ran off. <laughs> <laughs> oh man you know I was just thinking about that uh, Far Cry 3 I just started the playthrough of it uh, if you haven't watched it and you don't like profanity then don't watch it there's a lot of profanity uh, including a touch from me but uh, it says on the game's rating that there's nudity in that game that might be a little difficult because I can't actually you know what I bet I probably could put that on YouTube because it's it's an animation it's not like real uh, but I bet I'll probably have to blank that Welcome out somehow, to and that's going to be tough. Now let's find I'm Hancock and Adams. Terrible at video editing. Hancock and Adams. Hmm. Okay. No sign of Dawes. I hope he's all right. Should we have seen him already? All of a sudden, this area looks awfully free of loyalists. This is the house that Charles Lee was staying at, uh, or at least standing out in front of when I was Haytham. This seems extra, especially risky. No, it's where we stay now. What? Paul, Connor. That didn't make any sense. Good to see you. You need to leave. The Redcoats are coming. Aye, so Williams told us. Let them conduct their little search. They'll find nothing. You don't understand. Pitcairn intends to kill you. I'm afraid it's true. I suppose we have no choice then but to go. What of you three? Dawes and I will continue on to Concord. Connor, it's best you stay here and help our man John Parker hold the town. John Parker. It'll give us time to spread the word. Okay, keep on spreading. He's going to take my verbiage from here on out. He's been saying the regulars, but he's going to switch it up. Be more derogatory. The Redcoats are coming. So, one sink point. I feel like I probably could have got the other sink point kind of easily if I retried it. I, Especially right now, I think I could probably get it on the first retry. Um, how far away is this next objective? Uh, not too far. You know, I might not even need the horse. Uh, there is a trinket pretty close to me, too. 
I almost... Whoa, hey! Oh, that was my horse. There for a second I saw an assassin symbol on the minimap. It tricked me. Ah, oh, look at this! The regulars are forming up. Who is this? John Parker, <laughs> Lexington, and Concord. Well, let us begin. April 19th, 1775. Wait, was it... Was it April 14th before? Men! Did five days just pass? Don't fire! Unless fired upon! But if they mean to have a war, let it begin here! And so... Pick can. The militia begins. Wow. Disperse, you damn rebels! Lay down your arms and disperse! I bet Pitcairn got a you nice promotion. Hold your position, um. Traitors! Um. Back. You will have to make do with those who remain. Don't you lecture me, or not? Return fire! Return fire! Holy crap! There are a lot of redcoats up there. Concord and warn the others. I feel Show like to whoever leads there. Should be a man by the name of James Barrett. James Barrett. Go on now. I feel like uh, I should do basically the opposite. I feel like I should go start wiping out platoons of redcoats. Uh, here we go. I have three minutes, so you know I'm stealing a horse right off the bat, and I'm in the frontier, right? So let me ride fast, please. What? Did I step on a pebble? A pebble stopped me. It's foolish. Oh no, I did not mean to run over a Patriot. And a little closer, it's only been 20 seconds of my 3 minutes, so I'm guessing that this is uh, going to end up being boys, a pretty long together. journey here. Yeah, stick together boys and stay out of the way of the crazy Indian! <laughs> Warning, Connor did not kill Patriots. <laughs> no, actually, given that they're guards in some towns and they don't like assassins any more than Redcoats, the second they find out, you have to Get kill up. them too. Everyone run. There's a lot of particulate in the air here. A lot of fog, a lot of dust being kicked up. I like that. That's cool. I like the environmental changes that really speak to the battle unfolding. Ah, uh, ah, uh, okay. I feel like I'm running a little uh a little rally here. Hitting the checkpoints. Can't at all generate my own uh, direction here, but that's okay. I see a red dot too. Um, I wonder. I wonder if I could have tackled this differently and just went right after Pitcairn. <laughs> Rescue civilian hostages. What? Man. Blood's been spilled in Lexington, and there's more to come. The regulars are on the march. You don't say. And why do you think I'm met up here? Go home, or you get yourself killed. What? I have enough to worry about without some green boy looking to play at hero. I can vouch for him. John Parker as well. Yeah. Take a, uh, a second look there, chap. You've never Where's seen here? Captain, someone quite so... What? What? Already? Fear not. That man's no stranger to sticky situations. He'll be fine. I'm sure of it. He seemed soft. <clears throat> Your ladies finished gossiping? Parker seems to believe you're not completely useless, so I suppose there's a thing or two you might be able to help with. Parker wrote up a message that actually the said something starts. about me? We'll need to hold those positions there. They're critical to the defense of Concord. Good boys. Not used to soldier, and they need some with the experience to direct them. That's something you can do. You know it. You'd best be telling the truth. You have my word. Then I suppose all that's left to do is wait. Okay. Interesting that John Parker actually said something specific about me. He, uh, he produced that letter very hastily. I don't know, maybe Sir. just that I had the letter. Mount the barricades! No! Ensure my men hold those positions. If the Red Devils break through, we're finished. What would you have me do? Listen carefully. The Redcoats will form firing lines. Order the men to shoot just before the line is ready. Too soon and they'll miss uh -huh. their targets. Too late. 
and the enemy will open fire first. Understood. And if any of those bastards make it through, engage them. You must keep my men alive. Guerrilla warfare begins, and my role as a commander begins. Oh. Kill groups of regulars Wait with a single signal. order. Give order is an E. Okay, so right before they form a firing line, right? So here they come marching up. Look at them. What a bunch of fools. Okay, so they're going to try to form ranks. There they go. Nice. Nice. All right, I got other groups. What? Uh, what's this group over here doing? Is there a firing line forming up? I can't even see it. What are we dealing with? Oh, I see it. I think I got it just in time. Those guys were a lot further away than I expected. But I think that still worked out. Wait for the signal. Um, who's coming up next? I'm watching the red dots on my mini-map. I've got three de different red dots coming together at once. These guys actually seem like they're a little bit more out in the open. Uh, I can't give them an order. It's over here. Oh, Hold boy. Fire. Get ready, get ready, get ready. Go. Fire! Can I get to the middle before they need to fire? Oh, it's gonna be close. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna get it perfectly, I think. Shoot! And this one, I don't think I've gotten in time. Make but that's ready. okay. Shoot. They're already lined up, so shoot. I'm hoping they're going to fire while I'm over here. Wait, and back to the signal. far side. Oh, oh, my timing's so close. My timing's so Make close. Ready. Oh, it's just slow. Fire, 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 fire. fire. That might have actually gotten it. Maybe. It seems like they're taking Wait some time. Back over to the opposite side again. They're running me. Fire they're forming now. up. Fire, fire, fire. I guess they are all using muskets, Make poor ready. chaps. Uh, I think this line might be in uh, in Wait place first. Oh, oh, they're still marching. They're still marching. Moving targets. Apparently too hard to hit with the musket. They stopped. Do it. Middle. Come on. I'm talking to you. This horse Make really ready. could get a move on. Open fire. fire. It's close. There's actually another one close. I need to get these guys firing. Patriots Wait, remaining. Regulars defeated. Now. Yeah, yeah, the lines are formed in multiple different places, so I'm just going to start hitting them up and firing Shoot. as fast as I can. Right across all three lines. Please, horse, move. I had to let go of shift fire. and hit it again. Uh, can you fire twice? Can I give you an order to fire again? There's two packs of guys right there. These redcoats are Old really fire. stupid. They're lining up on a beach. Wait for my signal. Go. Fire, fire, fire! Oh my god. I really wish that uh, I could just like Wait for my tell them to fire at will once guys start grouping up like this. I almost think it'd be better to get off the horse. Just turning this guy around. It's ridiculous. Hold fire. Feels like I'm drawing like a tank around either side of this. Okay. Fire now. Carrying on. Fire, fire, fire. My god. Fire. How many do we have to kill? I guess just six more, right? Wait for my six. Shoot. They're shooting at you, you shoot back. You shouldn't be asking. Prepare yourselves. And I think I got that with at least Fall that back. secondary sync point. And the first inklings of guerrilla warfare proved to be super effective. We did it! The turning tail! Yeah! Still no civilian. Oh well. Didn't get that sink point, but that's okay. Where'd my horse go? How did he get rid of my horse in the middle of that? That's some nonsense. Let's see if we can get him back. 70 meters isn't real far. Uh, and honestly, I think I might be getting close to time. James! Is this James? Is this John Pitcom? Nope, that's James. James Barrett. And those are some dead redcoats and civilians. It takes a true monster to do something like this. At least they're gone. I should have struck when I had the chance. Do you know where Pitcairn could have gone? Back into the withered bosom of the British, no doubt. The withered so bosom? So regroup and plan his next atrocity. That's very I descriptive. Need to find him. Every day I wait, more will suffer. Chin up, friend. Many who should have died today now live because of you. Well, thanks for some... And, and what of them? Some appreciation. We do the best we can with what we've got. It is not enough. Hmm. It never is. 
You uh, have a dangerous choice in color there for your your robes, sir. You could very easily be mistaken and shot. More email outside of the Animus. Of course, I didn't get the full sync. I actually kind of like how they make uh, a lot of sync points difficult to get on your first attempt. Uh, that just kind of, I don't know, I guess adds to the replayability. Um, the way I play Assassin's Creed games, there's not a lot of replayability for the anyway. Of the glorious cause, Philadelphia, June 16th. I beg they will accept my most cordial thanks for this distinguished testimony of their approbation. That's George Washington. But lest some unlucky event should happen, unfavorable to my reputation, I beg it may be remembered by every gentleman in the room that I, this day, declare with utmost sincerity, I do not think myself equal to the command I am honored with. Truly, there is no pay, man better sir, suited to the task. To is that so? That I can no think of several. Could have Charles Lee. Have I know his voice. Do I know you? I would not expect you to remember. <laughs> Come, Connor. There is someone I want you to problems. meet. I will keep an exact account of my expenses. Sorry to pull you away Those like that, I but doubt not they the will last thing we need is the two of you coming to blows. Are you kidding me? That would be great right now. Connor, this is a perfect allow me place. to introduce you to our newly appointed Commander-in-Chief, George Washington. Ah, so you're the one who saved Sam and John at Lexington. It was the Patriots who did that. I merely lent support. <laughs> as humble as he is brave, we could use more men like you. I'm sorry, but if you'll excuse me, I should attend to Charles over there. He looks none too happy about being passed over for command. Are you kidding me? It was good to meet you, Connor. I suppose that would be like the Templars to try to get commanders on both sides, Pitcairn and Lee, the yeah. forces of Tell the Loyalists and Lewis Patriots. Pitcairn. I'm told he's taken shelter in Boston, where he's guarded by a thousand redcoats. What? The only way you're gonna get at him is if we draw him out. And lucky for you, we're launching an offensive against the city in order to do just that. I already cleared two Israel forts has in been Boston. been given command of our forces. Present this to him and he'll provide whatever aid you require. You'll find him at the encampment on Bunker Hill. You have my thanks. Bunker no Hill? Need. It's the least I could do. Pitcairn's a dangerous man. The sooner we're rid of him, the better. I would say the same of Charles Lee. Now that's an altogether different beast. Let us leave it for another day. Best you head to Boston, Connor. They've made uh, Pitcairn out to be the most soldierly. Of course, uh, William Johnson was kind of a steward type. Um, they made uh, Thomas Hickey out to be the the sea gentleman, uh, the uh, I don't know, the black market type. Uh, then of course Haytham, the leader. Uh, let's see who else. Um, I guess Charles Lee was kind of following in the footsteps of Haytham. I don't know. They made him out to be competent in about all regards. Jack of all trades sort. And uh, out of it we go. Okay, well, I'm ready for more storyline missions, but this video length is not. It has to end. So thank you all for watching. And stay tuned for more Assassin's Creed 3. Bye-bye.